Okay, so here we are. It's about 12.30 in the afternoon. That puts it uh, just barely short of uh, the 24 hours. It's 23 and a half hours. And uh, the reason that I'm coming to this before we get to the, the 24 hour mark here is that uh, the heat's up there pretty, pretty high. So uh, I think you can see that it might be 109 there for the Koji. And when we look at the, the setting, I only have the environment set at 93. So it's uh, doing its thing. And we will um, go ahead and do the same kind of uh, mixing that we just did at the last uh, encounter about three hours ago. Okay, I'm going to pull that out and then we'll take a look okay. at it. So uh, I've just pulled this out and uh, uh, looks like it's right on the edge here. Uh, I'll spell it out. This is uh, kind of a loose ball. Um, it's a little bit harder to work with, but not bad. Um, and we pull it out. It's looking great. Smells good. Need the little aroma aroma camera here. But anyway, so you can see much more of the uh, of the grain here. You have to hold it still. Uh, much more of the grain of the grain here is covered with uh, the koji mold this time over last time. It's a lot more uh, white flakes. It's not totally covered, but much more and. Uh, you know, maybe this one, if you look at this, you can see that's kind of a clump and it has a, you know, some spots on it and then some, some spots that don't have it. So that's uh, kind of the general idea. Most of this is not clumped like that, which is nice. Uh, we have very few clumps and, uh, um, you know, as you saw, it was just at a hundred and, it's kind of reddish, that's kind of odd. Um, anyway, a hundred and nine degrees um, that's getting up there uh, pretty high and I'm not sure exactly what the you know sort of what the top is but that's that's right up there so uh, I didn't want to let it go too much longer uh, before we kind of mixed it around a little bit get it ready now uh, this time we will uh, take out the water from the from the uh, incubator. Yeah, from the incubator, <laughs> the cooler, uh, and uh, that way we'll dry the the uh, environment up a little bit. Let the koji work its way into the center of the grain here, and uh, so we're all set to start pulling this back together here and to go back in. Okay, so I'm going to stick this in and take me just a moment to do that and then we'll um, kind of close out. Okay, so there we are. I've just pulled the, the glass out so there's no glass in the corner anymore. And we still have the metal plate there just to block the direct heat coming in on the koji. And then we've got it all kind of covered up and ready to go. Now. We'll start checking it more frequently as we move forward at this point, um, but it's looking good.